I got some weapons from our sweatpants. And we were just at this place and we're gonna be doing these bungee hook challenges. Alright, so I have to redo this whole thing because I stopped for a second there. Kind of annoying, but that's fine. I'll do this later. I'll just this isn't that hard anymore, I guess. Yeah, it's not nearly as frustrating this time. There we go. Alright, so if you if you destroy every single TT in this whole level, in this whole um section, then Mr. Cobbs will give you a golden spatula for it. It's also um an annoying way to get a golden spatula, but a pretty straightforward way of getting a golden spatula. So that's when that was completed. Now you go over here. And now over here there'll be another one. Now this one, you'll get hurt a bit, but I mean it's really easy to destroy the spatula because you've got no keys. I have to just aggravate the thunder tiki's and then it'll explode in your face, which is not that bad actually. And now as that one falls to the ground, it will die. And then you get all the ones in that one. And then there's just one more. One more section that we have to do, I think. Um, yep, it's the last section. That's the easiest way to destroy them. Just hit the one that's about hit this hit the the floating tiki, like right over there. Yeah. Oh wow, I mean it really I mean this one pretty easily. And now the thunder tiki ones are just really straightforward. You just touch the thunder tiki's and then they'll just die. You don't have to dive at them, you can just touch them if you really want to. But um it's a lot easier to dive at them than to just Yeah. And now as you hit the little fanfare, all the tiki's have been destroyed. And you hit this button, which I already did. Good work, boy. And you get a golden special for it. So, so now we only need one more left before we can do before we can do plankton. And sorry. And to do to do that, you have to. The easiest way to do that is to get this one. And I'll show you my method for getting shiny objects. The really easy way to get shiny objects is just to go to Mr. Miss Puff's time. And then just bubble bowl that, and you get like 200, and then you just do it again. And now I'm gonna stop the video here for now, just so I can um, get enough shiny objects. So, alright, guys, I'm gonna turn on the pants. And here's the, actually a bit of an easier way to get more shiny objects. Use that and then attack this, and then you'll get a good, like, 400, and you'll get the max combo in the game. And now we can go to Mr. Krabs and get our final shine, and get our final golden spatula for the final boss. So, let's go do that. Now that we have 72 spatulas, we can go ahead and enter the chum bucket and... Ha ha ha, lol 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 lol, I need 75. Ha ha, that's funny. Whoops. Whoops, guys, I need three more. That's fine. That's pretty stupid of me. Hmm, which one's that? Don't remember that one, but whatever, that's fine. Um, hmm, which one can we do? So this is not... Hmm. Oh, this one's kind of weird. I don't know how to do a lot of these. Alright, so this one's really easy to do. We can get that one. We can get this one pretty easily. Just find out more socks. That's an easy... Oh, I have three out of eight socks. Hmm. Alright, looks like I'll go sock hunting. Oh, this is also an easy way to get shiny objects. Um, but that's not nearly as good. Okay, so... I'm gonna go find some socks while you guys chill out, so see you guys later. Alright guys, I found another sock. If you return to this level after a while, and you come back and you destroy everything in Squidward's house, you'll find a sock in there. Squidward will tell you, 
jump around like an idiot, it'll make me smile. And then that's exactly what you do. And you get a sock. And then now we get the last sock. Here, blind Dutchman's graveyard. Get a lofter, maybe. <laughs> now this one's pretty simple. It's obvious that I can't believe I didn't do it before, but... All you do is just... Hang on, push up the clock this time. Oh, wow, no, 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 no. Okay, so... All you have to do is just first kill off this guy. First, and then kill off... Well, actually, I don't have to kill off that guy. I just, I'm just gonna go around that guy. That's what I usually do. It's a lot easier to just go around him. Just kill off that guy. Switch to Sandy now, and then there'll be a sock. You see the sock? Soon. Right up here. And to get to that sock, you can't get it. Well, actually, there we go. And that's another sock, and now we go all the way down to Patrick. And we return that sock to Patrick. And now we have 73 spatulas. Alright, and now what you can do is, the easiest way to get spatulas in the game is to just do these. These are really easy to do, just get the tiny objects. So that's, not exactly, what I'm, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Here, you just go to Sand Mountain, go to Miss Pup's time. And there are tons of shiny objects here. Just, it's really easy. I'm sure I already showed you this, but do that. And destroy that. And then you get super ultra mega monster combo. And then you just do it again. So I'm going to do that again and again until I get another spatula. So, um, I'll see you guys whenever that happens. Guys, I'm looking for no square pants. And if you look, I have 10,004 shiny objects now. I spent like 4 minutes on that, and now I have 10,000. So that's really how much you can get from that. You get a ton of shiny objects in that level. So... So I just talked to him twice. <clears throat> and now I have 75 spatulas. Yay. And now we have enough to go face the final boss. Yes. Oh wait, hang on. I can't resist. Alright. Oh, and this is also another good place to get them. Um, if you're looking for shiny objects, just go in here. Fire off around in here. Get a decent amount here, but not that much. And now, no, no TV time for me. Oh shoot, final boss time! All right, I will see you guys next time when we take off the final boss.